Hey, hi, hello, welcome back to Katie Vision, and hey, what's up, if you are new here. My name is Katie, and as you can see by the thumbnail or the title of this video, I do have a try-on haul for you today that I'm so excited about. I've had these pieces come in over like the past couple of weeks and I've definitely been tempted to wear. I've wanted to wear them, but um, a lot of these are for the fall, the upcoming school year. If you didn't know, I am a teacher and back to school is right around the corner. So when I was purchasing these pieces, I kept that in mind and I tried to pick pieces that I know I will make use of during the school year. The majority of the clothing I'm trying on for you today is from Old Navy. If you've been watching, you know that is like my go-to place for most of my outfits. I love shopping there. I do have a couple of clothing pieces that are from a favorite online boutique called Threads & Co. And then I have some shoes that I grabbed from Target. So I think I'm going to go in that order. I'm going to show you all my Old Navy purchases. We'll go into Threads & Co. and then I'll end with the shoes. All right, stay tuned if you want to see what I got from Old Navy, Threads & Co, and Target. All right, so here is the first piece. I did pick up this like turtleneck, mock neck tank from Old Navy. And again, keep in mind that these pieces are mainly to wear for this fall, winter season coming up and just all throughout the school year. I figured I'd make use of these. I do live in Minnesota if you didn't know that already. So the winters fall and winter does get pretty cold here. So I wanted to grab some pieces that I could use for layering and I thought this black color would just be like the perfect thing for that. And I am just wearing sweatpants. That's what I was wearing before filming this. So I do like the fit of this. It is not, it's not like super cropped, but I like the length of it because I feel like most of the undershirts or like tank tops I use for layering are super long and I do have, I do have a shorter torso and long legs. And with high rise jeans being my favorite, I know I'm not the only one, but I love wearing high rise jeans. So I feel like there's always a ton of extra fabric at the bottom there that I'm tucking in. But I feel like with this, it's going to be like the perfect length. It's probably hard to see with the black on black, but kind of sits just like right like this what the back looks like and I like it it's like this thicker thicker material and like I said this is gonna be a great layering piece just as a teacher I like my clothing items to go up a little bit higher and covering this area so this is perfect I like this I'll do my best to link everything and then also yeah just do my best to describe how things are fitting so I went ahead and grabbed this same piece, but also in the color white. So again, I thought this would be just another great, um, great piece to wear for layering. Um, probably never on its own, but maybe before fall sets in, I can wear this on weekends or whatever, but I wouldn't wear this on its own to my job teaching. <laughs> this is mainly for layering pieces so i got it in black and then i got it in white with old navy just for reference i usually well it depends i'm in between small and medium so depending on i guess the style of the shirt i go between sizes so these since they are a little more fitted and i wanted to wear them as like an undershirt i went with a small just so there wasn't much like extra fabric if that makes sense i wanted it to be pretty form-fitting so it'd be easy to put under like a button-up or a cardigan anything like that so all right so next up i got a couple other pieces for layering purposes i thought this was a really beautiful color pretty unique not like any other undershirt that i have and again i would wear this to layer i, I like this little ruffle detail on the bottom here i think it's fitting it really well again this is more of a cropped cropped fit. Um, I just think it'll be perfect to just tuck into those high rise jeans, throw over a button up or a cardigan like before. This is the back. Yeah, just a really nice fit and it does have like this rib detailing. Again, I got this in a size small because I wanted it a little more form fitting. And then I also grabbed it in the color white. Ooh, this, I bought these in a pack of two. They have a few different like color options, so I considered just getting black and white, but I definitely have black undershirts more than any other colored, so I thought I would go with this um, 
just change up the color a little bit. So I thought this was really pretty and then I feel like I'm gonna make a ton of use out of this one, especially if it's the same, same top, the same rib, just a different color. And I think this is gonna go really nicely under some of the pieces that I'll be showing you next. Okay, before moving on, my skin is so sensitive. I swear if I just like scratch it or touch it and then having those like high neck tanks on it, I'm reacting somehow. Oh my gosh. So let's just, let's try and ignore that, shall we? <laughs> All right, this next piece, I was so, this is like one of the pieces I was like the most excited for getting in, just getting me in that fall mood. It's such a beautiful piece that I can wear for the school year. I am wearing that little, white tank that I showed previously and I put on a pair of jeans so that I could show you more of this piece. We'll talk about the jeans in a little bit so hang tight but I was super excited about this next piece which is this beautiful like oatmeal colored cardigan. I went ahead and got this one in a size medium because like I mentioned before actually I ordered this in a small at first um, because I was watching I watch her clothing hauls all the time. I can't think of her name, but I'll put it up on the screen here. I, she purchased this exact item and she got a small and I realized that she's very petite and like her go-to size is a small, whereas mine is typically a medium, but sometimes I'll size down. So I ordered a small and then I immediately regretted it, got it in the mail, tried it on actually because I ended up going shopping in person at Old Navy. So the small was just, the sleeves were way too short. And then again, it was too tight around here. And then it was fitting more like this. It wasn't, I wasn't able to like close it. I don't know if that, that makes sense, but enough of that. Let me, I'll back up a little bit so you can see the full length of this. So again, we'll talk about, we'll talk about the jeans in a little bit. Um, but yeah, this is just this beautiful oatmeal color. It has pockets. I love the little slit detail here and I love that the sleeves are a little more loose fitting now that I got the correct size for me because then I can kind of roll them up if I need to during the work day. Um, just a beautiful color and I'm probably going to wear this combination right here a lot. Yeah, I think it just fits perfectly. Super comfortable. Like I already said, this is one of the pieces that I was most excited for. Super easy to style. I love the color. I thought this like lighter color would be perfect for the transition between um, summer to fall. So super excited about this. I'm glad I got the correct size for me. All right, let me show you some more tops. All right, so this next piece, I found so many, they had so many nice like button top, button top, so many nice button up like collared shirts at Old Navy. And I didn't purchase these online. I went ahead and I went in store because I really wanted to see them and feel them in person. Again, I was just keeping in mind pieces that I could wear as a teacher and I thought these were very, oh no. I think my neighbor is doing yard work so you can probably hear um, some like murmuring in the background. Bear with me, you might have to ignore that. This is what this shirt is looking like. It's just a blue and white striped. I love that I can button it up if I need to, I could do it all the way up like this. Again, I'm still wearing this little white tank that is perfect for exactly for a shirt just like this, where I just need a little undershirt. And this is what the shirt is looking like, not buttoned. I feel like I could go ahead and wear it like this. I could probably tie it up, although I feel like this is more like spring, summer style. I will probably wear it I'll probably wear it buttoned up and either all the way tucked in or I might just do like one of them tucked like this. Some other features, the sleeves, it looks like it's a little bit of like a balloon sleeve, which I really like that feature. It makes it stand out a little bit more. It does go a little bit longer in the back, but I would not personally, and it's up to you totally, I wouldn't wear this with leggings. I would definitely wear this with a pair of jeans. But yeah, I love, I love how this fits. I got this in a size medium. Again, the small just would have been too tight around here. And even with this one, like the arm length is kind of just right on the edge there. So a better look at the pattern and then the sleeves here. 
I think are just really, really beautiful. So a perfect piece to wear to work. I can wear this teaching. I think it's, I think that perfect combination of like dressy, but also casual. Lately, I've been trying to find pieces that I can dress up a little bit. Don't want to be super formal, but I want to, I want to dress professionally, if that makes sense. Like, don't want to be super formal, like business attire, but I feel like with this, I can pair it with some jeans and then depending on my shoes, I can make it look more professional. Love this piece. Uh, let me show you what's next. All right, so another top that I am just super excited about. Again, it's just a little change up, a little, a little more dressy than just a typical top. Again, taking advantage of this little white undershirt, I would, it'll probably be my go-to. Again, just a really beautiful blouse. I feel like, I feel like I'm gonna love wearing this at school. Um, it does have these, the sleeve detail, and then it's the same around the neckline has these beautiful ties for either just an accent. I don't think I will actually like tie them up, although I could, we'll see. I think I like how it, how they just sit though. I think those, that's a beautiful little detail. Here is a different angle just so you can see the full on. So this is a little more loose fitting and I kind of like that. I feel like I could if I wanted, of course, you could just tuck it in like that the back love this one again I just think it is a little more a little more dressy a little more formal just a really really pretty piece and I do like the like balloon sleeves I did get I did get a size medium in this as well I'll show you like with my arms the sleeves are not Quite long enough but I feel like I could since it does cinch a little bit I could kind of scoot them up a little bit and wear it more like I think I could wear it a little more like this because they would stay put like that so there we go all right so very similar to the blue and white striped top I showed you just another button up but I believe this one is more cropped which I thought was really unique so this is all like this is a very dark color it's almost black but not not quite there it's like a dark gray all right so here we go it's buttoned up and it only goes to about here I think with this I would probably do I, think I would roll these and then I'll probably just have it unbuttoned like one more all right so I love love how this is looking again I feel like it's that good balance between casual and a little more dressy a little more professional. You could tuck it in like this, but again, since it's cropped, I feel like it's a really nice, just a really nice fit. And yeah, like I said, it's almost like it's really close to black, but it's just like sh charcoal gray. I think it's a really nice color. I don't have any pieces like this, like button up, like dark colored shirts. I have a lot of light colored. Um, or like flannels that are buttoned up, but nothing like this. All right, so next up, I just have a couple more basics. This is a basic black t-shirt. It is a cropped style, short sleeve, and I feel like it hits just right. Like I can tuck it in a little bit if I need to, but I just figured this would be really nice. I can wear it on its own, or I could easily just put this under a cardigan or put it under a, like a button up. With this, I went for, I went with a size medium and I'm debating now if I could have gotten away with a size small just cause it is a little more like loosey goosey. But I think I like that it is a little more, that it fits a little more like this just because I might be wearing this on its own. I don't want it to be too form fitting. Yeah, I just talked myself into it. I like the medium fit. Might be kind of hard to see. There is this like ribbed and this pretty little detail around the edge and that's just on the neckline but yeah just another nice basic to have for the school year just to wear on its own like I said or to, to layer just a super easy piece to grab and I also grabbed this top this is kind of similar but this one has this little ruffle at the bottom very similar to those undershirts that I showed you 
and I thought this color was really nice. I don't have a ton of tops in this color. Probably will wear more often when we really get into the fall months, but I thought this would be really pretty for the winter months to put under a number of different items. So I got this one in a size medium as well. Okay, next up, let's talk about these jeans. I put them on to just have on for the last few tops. I am loving how these fit. As I go, I've been walking in and out to go change and everything, but they are super comfortable. I love the wash. I feel like I have a handful of jeans now in, in this same wash, like that lighter wash, but there are a few things about these um, that are pretty similar to jeans I already own, but there's a few features that are different and that I'm really appreciating. So let's, let's talk about these jeans. So these are the extra high rise sky high straight ankle jeans. So if you've been watching it, you know my thoughts on the button fly jeans. They're not always my favorite, but the more I've worn jeans with that feature, they haven't bugged me as much because I, I gave them a chance and they're not as annoying as I feel like I thought they would be. So some of my favorite jeans actually have that feature. Still, it's not my favorite, but it's not, they're not as big of a deal for me. So these do have that button fly. So here they are. And what I really appreciated about these, you guys, is the fact that they don't have any distressing. No distressing along the jean itself. Something else I come, came to realize, like at work, like I think it's okay to wear jeans, but I don't want to wear any jeans that have like tears in them. I'm going to save those for summertime or like weekends, but when I'm at school, I don't want to wear jeans that have tears in them. Just want to give you the best representation of these that I can. Um, I like that they do have, they have this raw hem. So they are an ankle pant. I do have fairly long legs. Love the wash. I think it's a really beautiful color. I feel like these are easily going to be going to become some of my favorite jeans. However, all the jeans that I've purchased from Old Navy so far, I've really come to love. So I have another pair of jeans to show you. And then um, I have a dress to share with you from Old Navy. And then we'll move on to the remaining pieces. Please excuse my dirty, nasty mirror. <laughs> okay, so I feel like these are a pretty similar fit to the ones I just showed you. These are though the OG straight, the high rise OG straight. This one does have that standard zipper and button, which I really appreciate. And again, there's no distressing along the jean and it does have that raw hem. I love how they're fitting. I don't think I mentioned, but I do typically grab a size four in old navy jeans. Sometimes I'll get a six depending on the style because some of the styles are a little more stiff, but these two so far, the ones I've turned on, they have a little stretch, so they fit just right. I feel like if I were to get any smaller of a size, would not be comfortable. All right, all right, help me out, you guys. I'm not, I'm not super sure. I'm not super sure about this one. So I got this dress. I'll show you the whole thing, but this is the color, and I think that's what caught me, um, what caught my eye. I love the color of this. I thought this would be a beautiful color again for that transition from summer to fall. And as a teacher, I feel like wearing dresses. The right kind of dress um, just can be super comfortable and an easy way to just like dress up the everyday look. So I really like the sleeves. I like that it comes up high. Um, I just love the coverage there. I got this in a medium, my go-to size. I think a small, I think this is the way to go if I am going to keep this. I think a small would not I don't think I would like it if it was a small. So let me show you the rest. All right, so I thought this feature was really unique. It like cinches here, like ties on both sides. So I think what I need to do is maybe just mess with, maybe I need to tighten these. So when I like pull it all the way down, which I think is how it's supposed to fit, but I feel like I'm wanting to like, I want it to be more like right here. So maybe, maybe I just need to cinch it in a little bit. Let me, let me know what you guys think. Should I hang on to this one? I love, again, I love the neckline. I love the sleeves. It's super comfortable. I love how it fits. I just don't know if I'm going to get annoyed with the cinched part. I definitely don't think I have to worry about this one. I don't have to worry about this one being too short. So I think I could really, I think I could make use of this one for this school year. And again, I love the color. I think I'm, I think I'm going to keep it. Let me know what you think though. Okay, this is the last piece from Old Navy. Let's move on to Threads & Co. 
two pieces from them and I think you're gonna love them. I'm so excited about this piece. So I was able to try this one on in store, I think a month ago. And I went ahead and just ordered it online because it was still available. So I'll link this one if I can. If not, maybe I'll link a similar item. But you should definitely, definitely check out the site anyways because Threads & Co has some of the cutest pieces I've seen. And this is a piece that was more for the, I think the spring, summertime. But I grabbed it um, at the end of the season here. And my plan for this is to wear this for... The fall season and I plan to just put on a denim jacket and then whip it out again during I think springtime it would be really beautiful as well so I love it. I think these sleeves are so beautiful they are adjustable so I can untie this and loosen it which I think I might then again I feel like it's hitting just right I could just use a little more a little more wiggle room from here it just kind of looks like a dress but it is this wide leg romper jumpsuit for you long-legged girls this is perfect like i can get away with wearing this with sandals i don't have to worry about it looking too short i'm glad i got it because i think it's gonna be like i said super cute for this fall i can get away with wearing it for a little while longer not too far into the school year but i love how wide leg look at <laughs> It does have pockets, which is a great feature as well. Yeah, super cute. Uh, one more piece to share with you from Threads, and then I'm going to share my shoes from Target, and that'll be a haul. All right, so the last clothing piece, the last clothing piece I have to share with you is a skirt. I, I think I own one skirt, and I think that's it. So stepping out of my comfort zone, people, I went ahead and grabbed this skirt. I'll get a better clip of it for you, obviously, but when I saw this, again, this is from, this is from Threads & Co. I loved the color, and there's just some so many little features about it that I appreciate, but the color is what really st stood out to me. I think it's technically, I think the color is camel. So again, a really pretty color for that summer to fall transition and I just have it on with this like white tank that I got that I showed earlier from um from Old Navy and I envision wearing this with a like a denim jacket I think would be the perfect uh perfect outfit great for teaching and I'm gonna make use out of this wear this into the school year for as long as I can so this skirt is very flattering Again, with skirts, I feel like it's kind of hit or miss because of my torso leg ratio. I can never find one that hits just right, but I'll show you how this one is fitting. All right, so this does have an elastic waistband. It's stretchy. I grabbed it in a size medium. I feel like it's the perfect fit for me. I think a small would be too, too tight. So I love that if I wanted, I could. I don't think I would do this, but you could hike it up. I could bring it all the way up to here if I wanted to. So depending on how I want to style it, I could bring it up or I can kind of let it just sit around where my hips are. It does have a beautiful slit on both sides and dun, 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 there are pockets. I love that. I love that feature. All right, so this is how it is fitting and I love the length. I feel like it's the perfect length. Having long legs, it can be a struggle. Again, I love how stretchy the waistline is. I feel like I can move around in this. I like the length, the slit, just beautiful detail. All right, so those are, right? Those are all the clothing pieces. Let's get onto the shoes. I bet this video is going to be a long one, but that's okay. That's okay. If you like watching hauls, if you're into fashion, you're not going to mind it because if you're like me, I love all those things. And I like, I like watching a good haul. I love getting outfit inspiration and I really like to inspire you guys as well. So let's get on to shoes. I have three pairs of shoes to show you. Um, two of them are the same, but I bought them in two different colors. And then let me just, let me show you. So I debated getting these because as you know, fall is right around the corner. I live in Minnesota. It gets cold. It gets very cold here. But I know that 
during the beginning of the school year, I am wearing sandals or open-toed shoes for a little while still. You know, things don't start cooling off right away. So I question whether or not to get these because they are sandals, but I thought I would make great use out of them. I already have, I won't lie, I wore them a couple times already because I couldn't resist. Um, and really so I could try them out too because if these are still available and you're like me and you like getting a good deal on on shoes, you could probably get these for a good price, like I said, if they're still available. And I wanted to give you like a little review. So these are some beautiful sandals from Target. I love this unique, I love the square toe. Um, this beautiful like quilted kind of detail that's very squishy. A lot of the reviews said to size up. So I read a few and I was about to size up. I do wear a size eight and a half. I'm glad I stuck with eight and a half. If I got a size nine, they would have been too big. It does depend though um, if you have narrow or wide feet, I, I would say. Um, my feet are pretty narrow. They ended up fitting me just right and I have even enough room on the end. I think I'll get a clip of me wearing them, but really like, really like these and I got them on sale. They were a good price. I'll show you them in black. So again, these are the same exact ones. I haven't worn these yet though. Had to break these out because I don't really have any shoes in this color. I do have a pair of heels, but those are not shoes I'm going to wear on an everyday basis. I think this early fall and then springtime I'm gonna wear these so much at school I feel like they're like dressy enough they're not too they're not casual which again I'm trying to step it up a little bit when it comes to my attire at work I feel like these will look really nice with the jeans I shared with you and even like this skirt I'm still wearing the skirt from my last clip I feel like this could be a nice pairing um but yeah again i stuck with my regular size read the reviews for yourself if you are interested to make the decision um to stick with your size or size up again it really depends if your feet are narrow this is a pretty narrow sole is that what you call it yeah so love these and then let me show you one more pair that is going to be perfect for the fall these are beautiful little booties did i mention okay those sandals were the brand a new day these are the universal threads universal thread brand at target again i got my size eight and a half stuck with it this pattern isn't that beautiful and it has these it has a little side zipper so that's really nice um the heel is not too tall so i figured i would make great use out of these for the fall time they were a little risky because they are light I'm like am I gonna get these super dirty maybe but then I can clean them and all all will be well in the world it'll be okay right I love like these little booties these are perfect for teaching in like I said just a little more dressy uh let me I need to make sure I'll get some clips of how these shoes look okay so like how cute is this here are the booties with the skirt I just tried on with this top, let's just throw on, throw on a denim jacket. And this is, I feel like the perfect fall or like transition to fall outfit for as a teacher or many other careers. I feel like this is a cute little fit. All right, so that's gonna do it for my little fall back to school haul. I hope you enjoyed. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel because it really does support me. Some of my favorite videos to film are ones like this, filming hauls. I do like to do a week of outfits as well, so you can expect a lot more of those from me now that this school year is going to be up and running soon. And I will be getting up and getting ready for work every day, so I'm excited to share some outfit inspiration with you. I also share content related to wellness, lifestyle, faith related, and then I've been sprinkling a little bit of my teacher, my teaching experience into these videos as well. Let me know if you'd like to see more of that. In the past, I've just kept that, I've kept my work life, teaching life separate from this channel. I've shared before that this is more of like my creative, creative outlet to pursue, pursue my passions outside of teaching. Let me know in the comments your favorite outfit or your favorite piece from this haul and let me know what you would like to see next on Katie Vision.
Thanks so much for watching. Take care, guys. I'll see you in my next one. Thank you.